and I would like to thank you for five years of unity in diversity. It is our responsibility to keep Europe together and let rebuild Notre Dame and Happy Easter. Um, since the election of Jeremy Corbyn as Labour leader have really come to the fore and uh, you know you're on programmes like this, you're all, all over the place and you are a self-confessed communist. So tell us a little bit first of all about how you came to this point, which we were going to talk more about but we sent you to meet one of your heroes. Here's the film. I'm gassed. We are on the brink of civil war. You are on the brink of civil war in the United Kingdom. They are on the brink of civil war in America. We are on the, the brink of civil war in Italy. The people in Tamworth use the word packing. No, because there's no packing around two sides. Of Some also glued themselves to the carriage. I'm a GP, or oh, just retired, so I can. I've got children who are grown up, so I can do this. So I'm doing it for everyone who can't. I'm on my way home from Extinction Rebellion. It's half past ten at night, and I should have been in bed ages ago. But you know what? I feel so much better. Clearly, Extinction Rebellion cures all ills. Not only addresses planetary health, but personal health as well. I just, I suppose it's... The uplift effect, I just feel great. I, I grew up in colonial Africa. The Africa that I know, uh, every country that I have known has collapsed a bit. I, I, I was in before, during and after the, 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 the civil war in Yugoslavia. I've seen civil And, you know, we all have, every country has fragmentary. Uh, impulses. We, you know, we, we, we have to hold things together one way or the other to keep the Scots in line, the Welsh in line, the English in line, the Irish in line. And it's a united kingdom. If you start unpicking, if you start saying, this is not fit for purpose, I warn you, you, you sow the wind, you will reap the whirlwind. And that is the most frightening thing, that this betrayal of Brexit is going to be. With a very long and boring film, um, let's, it, was, it was unintelligible.